Welcome to this Windows channel and this is a tips and tricks video. It's kind of an updated tips and tricks. I already talked about this feature in the past, but it's been slightly modified and updated for the creator's update. So I thought I'd do another video about it. And the um, thing is, when you have Wi-Fi on your computer, desktop, laptop, tablet, you can actually share that internet connection that you have with other people. So for example, say your desktop computer has an ethernet connection, but also a Wi-Fi card, you plug in with a cable, well, you can use that Wi-Fi card to actually send the internet to a device in your home. So for example, if you would not have a router, but wish to at least connect a device, you would be able to do so without having a router. You have a laptop, you're connected to Wi-Fi, maybe on your phone, maybe you're connected to Wi-Fi somehow, and somebody comes over, you want to share your internet connection, don't give them your um, you know, uh, network key for your router. Play safe. Give them internet through your Windows 10 machine. And how you do that? Simply go into the settings. Go into network and internet. And on the left side, you'll see mobile hotspot. When you click there, you'll see share my internet connection from here. Okay, mine is Wi-Fi 3. But if you have Ethernet or if you have some other type of internet, or if you have more than one way to connect to the internet, all the ways to connect show up here. That's the first thing. Then you've got something with just below it that's network name and network password. Now, by default, you see here, it's called My Laptop PC, and there's a default network password, which is the Wi-Fi password that they will have to enter on their device if they want to connect to you. So you can edit this and change it to whatever you want. So you can change that to, uh, you know, My Internet Share or anything that, you know, uh, you want to give a name to. And you can also change the network password. Uh, keep it a little complex to make sure that nobody can, you know, connect. And what's cool with this is you got the on off switch right here. So once that is done, just turn this on and now you're sharing the internet. What's cool also is you have the number of devices connected. As you see here, eight devices can be connected at the same time. This number can vary depending on what type of connection you've got, but um, you know, you can share your internet with pretty much um, anybody around you. And of course this works as a local area network that means it works in your home not really farther than that you have to be you know not that far away from your computer to enjoy the wi-fi of course and you know it's a great way if you don't have a router to connect another device you might have at home with your computer through this mobile hotspot uh, feature which is kind of cool so uh, really easy to use and really cool then all you'll have to do, for example, in my case here, all I would have to do is take my device, search for the network called my laptop PC, and when I click on it, simply enter the password that's here at the bottom. Once again, you can edit and change that. And it's really cool because you can, of course, uh, share your Wi-Fi with anybody around you. And it's safer to do this because you've got an on-off switch than to give your you know router password to somebody and you're not sure uh, also you know anywhere you are if you have internet and you want to share it it's pretty cool because you know people can connect on your computer uh, temporarily and you know when it's all over you just turn this switch at off and uh, there's no more internet available there's also in the um, action center a button for mobile hotspot and it's right here so you can turn it on or off by this button if you wish if you enjoy my videos please subscribe give us thumbs up if you have any comments questions suggestions let us know and hope you enjoy our little tips and tricks videos